Hello guys and welcome back to Igniting Illumination and in today's video I'll be going back and coloring Ash Ketchum from Pokemon so let's get started once again I've gotten the picture into my phone and right now I'm going through the lines and digitally inking my drawing I lowered the opacity so that I could concentrate on filling in the lines correctly or making any necessary adjustments. So, thanks once again for tuning in to watching this video. Um, after we've uh, finished the uh, inking, we're going to start coloring ash ketchup. So, once again, let me know in the comments what you guys think about this uh, kind of videos that I'm doing. Also, if you guys like and want to support me keep doing these videos, please leave a like and a subscription would be much appreciated as well. Once again, I really appreciate any person watching this video. It's, it's, uh, it's amazing. So, thanks once again and so what I've decided to do is going to... I'll do a few more of these coloring videos and then I'll go back and... Uh, I'll go back to the way I started doing things. So I'll draw a new character with pencil. Let me know guys if you want to see a specific character. Let me know in the comment section so I'll get right to work on that. So, but otherwise... Uh, so yeah, I'll draw an, a new character and the next day it will be a coloring video of that character and the day after that will be another character and then the day after it will be a coloring. So that's the format I'm uh, aiming for right now. Um, let me know if you like it. I think it's pretty sound, so we're, we're going to go for that. Alright, so now we're going to begin coloring in his hair. So his hair is going to be black, so you want to create a new layer for his hair, just for the hair, and color it black. So the thing that I usually do for the inking part now is that the outlines of the face, the outside of the hat, the clothes, outside of the clothes, basically, you want to go with a thicker brush, but for the details, so that like the details of the clothes, details of the cap, of the face, you want to go back to a smaller brush when you do it and it kind of makes it uh, the drawing kind of pop up too. it makes it more realistic it it in general makes for better drawings you want to make sure and you that you do that all right so as I'm finishing up coloring the hair right now once I get that done I'll move on to the next part so the eyebrows color them in black too. Um, Ash Ketchum has pretty, his eyebrows are pretty thick um, in this drawing at least. Uh, the sides of the mouth, make sure you fill those in as well. And the black shirt that he's wearing, you want to make sure that you capture that as well. Make sure you also fill in the eyes with a black color. Leave the highlights at the top though. Now for the skin color, get a kind of a peach color fill in that in a separate layer as the first base color for the skin so make sure you get that done and we'll be adding in a second layer for the skin which will be the shadowing where we'll use a the darker or darker shade of peach so now you want to make sure once that done is to color the the cap that he's wearing red you want to use a dark red and you're going to basically go in and color the red uh, throughout the cap the sides of the cap leave the middle of the cap white uh, just the design of the cap that he's wearing uh, the logo will go in and color it dark green make sure you get that done as well now the mouth is going to be red so start off with a lighter shade of red for the tongue and at the top you want to go in with a darker shade of red and at the sides of the mouth instead of it being black you want to make it a 
a deeper, a really dark shade of red. So make sure you do that. Color in the shirt that he's wearing, it's kind of a navy blue. Uh, we'll also go in later for a second layer with a darker shade of blue. Alright, so make sure you color his uh, the cap red, the sides of the cap is red, the logo is going to be a dark green, oh, and the cap red is going to be a dark red. And uh, the sh <laughs> shirt that he's wearing is going to be blue, but his sleeves are going to be white, so let's keep that in mind. So now I'm just going through and adding a second col base color to his face, which is going to be the shadowing. So you want to get a darker peach color and just do that for the neck and for the face, the top side of the face, like cutting a bit above where the iris is and the right side of the face. And you want to shade in the color that he's wearing, the top of the cap as well. Get a darker blue and just go beneath the color that he's wearing to get that shading. And this has been Igniting Illumination, guys. Thank you for watching. Any feedback is appreciated, leave that down in the comments and I'll read them, I'll answer them, I'll take any feedback, it's much appreciated. Once again, this has been Igniting Illumination, thank you for watching.